Right here guys, so this is a wall, Jesus far out. Hate it when the back wheel slips and starts to go in front of you, not in front of you, you know what I mean, it slides out to the side. Always gets your heart going a bit. There we go, we're all right. So I just wanted to do a uh, little bloody uh, video for the, you, the crew. Um, me and Alistair have just done the video for the uh, Rattlers Pass. And now what we're doing is we're going to head, we, there's a dam in the middle of, I don't know, it's somewhere way over there, there's no direct track to it. What happened? Oh, I think he's going to let some air out. He was saying it was getting a bit bloody sketchy. I'll come back to you guys. Righty a Hey, your goggles. So, what the hell was I talking about? I was telling you that... <laughs> the video for the crew guys because you blokes are bloody awesome um, so yeah I've there's last night I jumped on the bloody uh, Google Maps and um, I knew that we were going to be out this way and we don't in this section if you watch the Rattlers Pass you'll know what I'm talking about we don't normally come this way because it doesn't really lead to a lot so but we've just seen a few more tracks and stuff and we're thinking, well, there is some stuff here that we haven't bloody, uh, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, no, I'm hitting the end. Hang on. This one's stand on a map. Bike's gonna go. Oh, come on. Oh, the joys. <laughs> Bloody hell. Oh. trying to push you. Can you, are you able to just steady my bike <laughs> and yours at the same time? Got it. Oh, get these bloody goggles off. Sweat. Like a Mr. Bean episode. Yeah, exactly. Alice is saying it's like Mr. Bean episode. Oh. Oh. All right. <laughs> That'll do it. Fuck. Okay, we're professionals. Yeah. <laughs> professionals we are. All right, got it. Oh. Right, guys, bloody hell. Oh, it doesn't take much to you. get you hot and sweaty <laughs> and out of puff. Let's not do that again. No. We come to a log, we stop, stop. we before it. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Now, it would have been cool if it worked. <laughs> I could have seen it just pushing out. Yeah. yeah. All right, let's go. <laughs> I suppose that's a bit of the behind the scenes stuff. 
some of the stupid shit me and uh, oh there's a wallaby me and Alice to get into So I haven't been on this track, Alistair's done this track, which is going to lead us to the big, uh, I think it's Spring Gully or something, it's a reservoir, like a lake thing. And then from there, that takes us to, uh, we can get on to, or get close to Serpent's Run, but we'll be on the other side of Serpent's Run. Ah, so here we go. Oh, this is all right. Love it when we've got our. Um... Oh, we're going to the red port, aren't we? Yeah. Well, where does that one go? I don't know. Let's follow that. All right. Bloody oath. Why not? You just never know what's around the corner or down a track. Hey. <laughs> Bloody great. Tripod is still there. So I suppose guys what I wanted to say is thank you very much for the bloody support and the continued support. I mean you guys, some of you guys have been with me from day one when I first started up that Patreon account. You know some, you know, some people have jumped off and it's, <coughs> they've left reasons why, because um, you have that option if you do that. You can just select a standard, uh, you know, why, you know, for other reasons or I'm not, whatever what there is, but, you know, I understand, you know, I'm no different than you guys. Circumstances change all the time through life where, you know, shit gets a bit tight and you can't afford to bloody do it anymore and, you know, priorities and all that shit. So, yeah, I'm really appreciative. <coughs> I just hope I, uh, can keep bloody doing videos that you guys like I suppose and you know whoop. the thing that I hear the most is it's it's not the whiz bang stuff it's just it's just the stuff that I do it doesn't oh we're on that shit track this is the Billy Gate gruff track it's real rocky it's a pain in the ass we didn't want to do it yeah back and follow that other one <coughs> What they say, nothing ventured, nothing gained. So now we, oh, hey. now we know uh, for next time where this track goes to. Same with if we do that track, we can come back. You know what I'm talking about. We're mud mapping mentally. Yeah. So and. I, getting trying to get back on track um, I've been obviously very busy trying to get shit done around the house just to get it to the point where I can then relax and just then concentrate on the videos and then just do every now and then you know bits and pieces around the house my main focus at the moment has been the house even though I'm still whacking out at least one video a week you know, I'd like to be able to do at least two a week. Uh, but with the trying to get the bloody house to a certain point, and I've, that picket fence and the arbor is all now done. Uh, tomorrow, because today's Monday, tomorrow or the next day, hopefully, Renzo's going to come with his bobcat or whatever the hell backhoe thing he's got to clean up all that front dirt. So then I can lay the road base and... Um, have that all done. That means the front's done and that job's done. Then it's just get that side gate done so I can get the motorbikes in and out of there really easily. Once that's done, that should be a pretty quick job um, to get that done. And then it's getting that the shed done. I've got a guy waiting on a quote to get the um, the gutters done. So we've done the insulation. And that was the things we wanted: the insulation, the gutters, and having a yeah, a shed. Obviously, the picket fence wasn't important, but that was, um, you know, you've got to do stuff. I like to keep Nay happy, and that has certainly made her happy. Not that she's a grumpy or anything, but yeah. 
So once all that's done, then I can really fully concentrate on on uh, on the videos. And of course, that includes the tag along rides and the ramble rides and all that kind of stuff. Oh, geez, that's all right. I did that all right. So if you noticed the KDM 1090 or the 1090, I shouldn't. I keep saying KDM 1090. Just got to say 1090. 1090 bottomed out there. I don't know whether he's, oh, he's heavier too. He might have went a little bit harder than me, but I just uh, floated over that. That was pretty good. Normally, I always stuff up on the log crossings, and Alistair's really good at it. So, where we're, we're trying to get to this dam place, and there's a bit of a clearing. And it's out of the way there's I can't see that there's a track that leads us directly to it, which means that it's not going to be frequented. And what me and so there's that big res at over there. So what because me and Alistair, I've said it, um far out guys, I'm all over the joint. I'm trying to ride a motorbike and talk to you guys. <laughs> um the back to basics. So on a dual sport bike or a venture bike. I want to get through the back to basics and try and hone the skills and stuff that you know I've partly got but I just don't think they're they're not honed enough because I don't ride constantly enough like this to hone those skills and so obviously yeah I want to be able to video it and share that stuff so not that me and Alistair are bloody instructors or know what's the best way to do it but just show you what we're trying to do for ourselves um, to sorry man to uh, I was just saying about the back to basics and we're trying to find that location because it might be a really cool spot yeah, where yeah, people sure. aren't so whether it's you know log jumping um, the slow riding cornerings and all that it might end up being a really cool spot that we can set something up Definitely. where we can come out and do those yeah. videos there That'd be great fun. Yeah, and obviously, yeah, bring you guys along with it. Rightio, so I'm going to stop this now. So, again, guys, thanks heaps for the support. I really appreciate it. You know I do anyway. Um, so now we're going to just try and find our way there, and then we'll, we're will we going to do a bit of a... We're going to do a bit of a, hopefully, a um, talk about, you know, the, the panic attacks that I have, the stuff that you've bloody dealt or deal with. Yep. Yeah, you know, the normal bloody bullshit that blokes have to put up with. Not just blokes, women to do too as well. All right, I'm shutting up, guys. Keep on riding, and if you ain't riding, keep on keeping on. All right, things just got a little bit more interesting. Hoppa! Yeah. I oh, know what he's trying to do. He, does, he wants to go on a on a straight, not diagonal. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Oppa. Oh, look at that. They've actually made a little route for us. Look at that. Oh, isn't that so convenient? <laughs> I love it. All right. We'll let Alistair go. It's always better watching. the bloody neutral there for a minute well I'm liking this track it's a little bit bloody different nice look at that windy windy I say we're gonna obviously be going up in a minute which hopefully doesn't get too hairy Oh yeah, I can see it. I'll let Alistair get a little bit ahead. Alistair's gearing is uh, his lower down geared. So he can trundle a little bit slower than me. Oh, it's all right. It's not gonna be as steep as I thought it was. Too easy.
Yep. So I'll have to, that's another track that we can uh, can do. So this is a great little spot. I just didn't realise there was all this out here. And I would say this is a spot in where we are. Oh, this wouldn't be a frequented. Oh shit! How's that? I nearly whiskey throttled it way when I should not have. Um, yeah, obviously not a lot of people come out this way, whether it's in four-wheel drives or I'd say motorbikes would. But, um, uh, he took that line. I don't want that line. I want this line. Nice. Beautiful. Not sure if you can see it. But it's just rocky. This is just loose rock, so you've got to take it easy. <clears throat> Coming down shit like that. So easy for those loose rocks, especially going downhill for your front wheel to bloody kick out. Wow, there's so much more here than what I expected. Yeah, this is yeah. pretty cool. Yeah. Oh. Let's see where we are. Are we nearly there? Yeah, but it's just over there. But... I'd say it's there, yeah. Yeah. There we go. All right. Cool. I didn't. When I was looking at the sat phone, I didn't think there was going to be any um, tracks leading. I couldn't. I couldn't see the tracks, but see the trees hide the track. So that's really good that we've got a. Uh, track to the dam, although we're going the opposite way, I think. Whoa. Ah! Jesus. Alright, looks like Alistair's taken us to Crazy Town. That's going to just head us way back to that. Going the wrong way. I'm sure he'll figure it out in a minute. Yeah, I think we've got to go back that way. That one looks normal, but... Yeah? So go up around and see what it is? Yeah, well, we're getting further away from the track. Yeah. Over. I think we just go back there and see if we can find our way to it. Yeah, all right. Oh, look at that, a bloody car. <laughs> oh, geez, that's a bit scary, that one there. I'd say that would be a stolen car. Someone's done a joyride in it. Killed it coming in here. Then they bloody set it on fire. Leave no trace. Nice, Alistair. Rightio. So I know I said I was going, but it got all a little bit interesting, so I thought I'd bring you guys back. So hopefully I'm not boring you out. Ugh. So we're gonna have to do a bit of bush bashing down here, I reckon. Uh, I think we have to go back to the, uh, the corner of that fence line. How far back is that? Well, I wasn't far, but we're gonna go over. So you don't think we could get through there? Is that a trap? I don't think that's a good trap. Hang on, we'll go and have a look. We're going to, guys, we'll go and have a look. Oh shit. It's not really a track. I think this is water runoff. Ah, uh, but we're gonna get caught. But he should do it. We'll give it a We'll give it a whirl! Says Mark on the DR650. <laughs> He's taking me to worse places. Yeah, I reckon we should be able to wing our well, because this is obviously the way that the water runs. So it's not a track as such. It's just a, uh, a way in. Look at that, no feet down. He's doing bloody marvellous. <coughs> I 
Well, if we want to do uh, over logs and stuff, this is a good spot to do it. Oh. Follow me, Alistair, follow me. I'll take you astray. Bloody. Nice. Oh, it's, geez, it's getting... Wow, it's... Oh, shit, okay. I don't know whether... Oh, no, that's all right. It's still going. See if he's... Is he coming? He's... If I just keep going, he'll eventually he'll come. Because he knows that if I'm getting through it, he's going to get through it. All right, go this way. Now, when I say f physically, I can go further, but skill-wise and all that, um, I'm not going to go any much further than what... Oh, all right, okay. I might be on the wrong bloody side, actually. Hang on, guys. Alrighty, hey guys, we just did an assessment and I don't think we were as... The sat wasn't um, updating. Right now, Mark, bike does all the work. You go up, you let it roll down. Oh, look at that, nice. We'll just leave Alistair there. Oop. Try and work out which way to go. Make sure. All right. Yeah, he's got it. Yeah, that's it. It's the only problem with the big bike, the KDM 1090. She's a bloody nice bike, and it's very, very capable. It's just, you know, it's just a big weighted bike. So when you get into, you know, tricky stuff, whoa, I better get on this side. It's just so much harder to manhandle that thing around. You need to be someone like bloody Alistair getting into shit like this. But for me, I just, I, I wouldn't be able to do it. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to stop bloody rambling on. And uh, I will leave this here. Again, thanks for the support. Yay! And, uh, yeah. Cool. Oh, Jesus. So now we're on a bloody single track. On the other side of this, there's a race just down below. On the other side is what we call, or what I call, Serpent's Run. It's, I shouldn't be telling, I oh know this is the crew video, God. Um, it's Serpent's Run. And actually, it was the maintenance track for the race. And uh, But it's now a walking track, so you're not really supposed to be on. Bloody hell, guys. <laughs> Where are you taking us, mate? Oh, you, I'm following you. Man, I'm going to call that Rabbit's Run. Yeah, yeah. That's, That's good. Yeah, so we'll have to add that to the uh, to the map, guys. So, I've just pulled... So, we've been on that side. So, this side is Serpent's Run, and it's basically track like this. Just follows around. It's really cool. Um, 
but on the other side is the uh, is the single track. Real tight single track. Yeah, yeah, the I'll trees. I was surprised. Yeah. Uh, those, just, just because it's so physical, it's just hard work. Physical on those trees. Yeah. So many trees so close together. Oh, yeah. You want to hold this and film me? This is just for the. Uh, just doing this for the crew, guys. Yeah. And this. Why I brought this? I reckon. Oh. That's gonna cool me down. Yep. Like that out like that. Make sure it's facing the right way. Doesn't really matter. Oh. Nice and cool, eh? That is just shit hot, mate. Yeah. Shit hot. You should bloody get down and get some water on you. Uh, I haven't got one of those things. Oh, I'll rub it on your head. God, how far down is it? Oh, you should be able to. Uh, I reckon you should be able to reach. Oh, or maybe did, not. Did you reach down there? Well, here. Rinse that out and just use that. Uh, did I? Oh, how do you do it? Oh, maybe I've got longer arms. Oh, because I went over. Whoa. Oh. Oh, I really Push. <laughs> there you go, use some of that. Uh. Oh. There you go. Yeah. So we'll have to get you one of those. Yeah. Cool. All right, guys. So we're uh, hopefully uh, we're going to head back that up that track there. We'll have a look at the map, I reckon. Yeah. See if we can get to this friggin' dam. Cool, all right. Hey, <coughs> seems like it's fenced in. There's an old fence. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. 